Hi guys, it's Emily from Smart Home Sounds. If you haven't heard of us before, we're a home audio retailer dedicated to helping our customers find the right speakers for them. We make videos like these so you can make a more informed purchase decision. So today we've got the Bowser Milkins Formation Flex, which was released this year in 2019. We're going to take a look at some of its top features and how it fits with the Formation range. So the rest of the Formation range was released earlier this year and it included a sound bar called the Formation Bar, a large speaker called the Formation Wedge, a subwoofer called the Formation Bass, a pair of powered speakers called the Formation Duos, and finally a device to connect your old hi-fi equipment in with the system called a Formation Audio. Now in that lineup, they were kind of missing something a bit more affordable and slightly smaller, which is why they later introduced the Flex. Um, now the Flex can be used as a standalone speaker, in a pair or as rears in a surround sound system and it comes in at £399. So first of all let's talk about the design. Now it's definitely a very sleek and premium looking speaker and it fits in really well with the rest of the Formation range and in particular it looks very similar to the Formation bar with this um, mesh finish it's got around the outside and with the gold highlights. So the top panel is my favourite part of the speaker. It's a glossy black finish which looks really sleek um, and it actually lights up when you go near it so it shows the play pause button and the volume controls. Um, the speaker itself stands at 21.5 centimetres tall and is 13 centimetres wide, so it is slightly larger than other speakers in the category, but it's still a very compact speaker itself. So on the bottom it's got a recessed power connection for neatness, and it's also got an ethernet port for a wired connection to your router, um, as well as a reset button. So looks wise, um, I think it's nearly a 10 out of 10 from us. We really like how the speaker looks and it's definitely got a premium finish. So let's move on to how it sounds. So firstly, the Flex is definitely one to consider for music streamers as it offers the highest quality of music streaming currently available, 2496 bit, as well as the best standard of Bluetooth, Bluetooth Aptex HD. Internally, it has a decoupled dome tweeter which is taken from the Bowers & Wilkins 600 series and helps to produce studio quality vocal clarity. It also has a 4 inch woven glass fibre cone which helps to ensure rich bass and the mid-range and each of those drivers has a huge 50 watt power amp which uses DSP totalling 100 watts which is massive for a speaker of this size. So it fires from the front, sides and rear which means it's got great dispersion and it will sound good no matter where you are or where you place the speaker in a room. So the top end is great um, but it's the low end that's most remarkable about the speaker and it can produce tight sweet sounding bass which makes a change from the normal monotone bass you get in other speakers in this category and there's absolutely no denying that the Flex can produce sound which exceeds its, uh, the norm for its form factor. In terms of control and setup you need to plug in your speaker via mains power and you then need an internet connection as you will be using the Bowser Milk Transformation app to set the speaker up. Now the Bowser Milkins app um, is a really premium looking app and it's really nice to use. Um, the setup was one of the quickest setups we've encountered on the market. However, it doesn't have quite as many features as something like the Sonos app would have as you don't actually use the Bowser Milkins app to control the speaker at any point apart from adjusting EQ settings or adding an additional speaker to your, um, to your home sound system. Um, we do however hope that they will add more features to become more similar to something like the Sonos app in the future but we'll have to wait and see. So as you don't use the Bowser Milkins app to control the Flex, um, you can choose between Apple AirPlay 2, Spotify Connect, Bluetooth APTX or Rune. Now as they are all formation speakers are Rune ready, that means they can be used to play high res audio which is a great feature. So in terms of wireless connectivity, Bowers and Wilkins have created their own mesh system which means that their speakers can communicate seamlessly. Now as this isn't reliant on Wi-Fi, it means that um, they can ensure perfect synchronisation between their speakers. So if they are set up in stereo pair mode or different speakers around your home are grouped, it means that latency will be reduced to around one microsecond. Now the name Flex was derived from how flexible this speaker is and that's because it can be used as a standalone speaker in a stereo pair or as rears, perhaps with the formation bar or if you added the sub as well it would be part of a 5.1 surround sound system. So if you're considering the Flex you're probably looking at other speakers in the market such as the Sonos One or the Apple HomePod and obviously the Flex is slightly more expensive. However, it is a more premium looking speaker and has a more polished look we feel um, as well as being a slightly more powerful speaker than others in the same category. So in summary, we're really big fans of the Bowser Milkins Formation range, in particular the Flex. We think it's a really good speaker if you're looking for room filling sound either on its own, in a pair or as part of a 5.1 with some of the other Bowser Milkins Formation speakers. 
Um, we do feel like it's a high quality speaker with a premium finish and it does provide really good sound. Um, there are a couple of negatives to highlight. It doesn't offer voice control if that's something that you're looking for. Um, and obviously you can't get any native apps within the Formation app, so you can't control your music from within the app. But it does really come down to what you're looking for in the speaker. Bowles and Wilkins have put more emphasis on how the speaker sounds as well as the premium finish of the speaker rather than adding some of the extra frills that other speakers in this category provide. Um, so really, it's if you've got an appreciation for music more than the average music listener that you can take advantage of this speaker. So that wraps up our review of the Formation Flex. We hope you found that helpful. As always, if you've got any questions, do feel free to get in touch or leave a comment below. Um, don't forget to subscribe to our channel so you don't miss any of our future videos. Um, thanks for watching and we'll see you soon.